this is Jenny from Mesa Power. As we know, lithium batteries are renowned for their increasing energy density and extending cycle life, making them an essential component in numerous devices and industries. When it comes to enhancing the performance of lithium batteries, manufacturers come into play, including the material use, discharge depth, charge and discharge voltage, and especially the temperature. In today's discussion, our focus will be on the impacts of temperature. Lithium battery has a wide range of application environment when customers are in the process of selecting batteries. The temperature of the intended installation environment frequently plays a significant role in their decision making. Generally speaking, Lithium batteries operate within temperature spectrum of minus 20 to 60 degrees Celsius. Some experts suggest that 15 to 35 degrees Celsius as an ideal range. Within the, these temperatures, the batteries function optimally, can prolong the battery cycle life. Let's start from the consequence of low temperature on battery's performance. When batteries operate in colder temperature, typically below 0 degrees Celsius, which is common in countries and regions at high latitudes like Russia, Canada, Greenland. Its performance experiences notable setback, mainly reflecting in low discharge capacity and decrease of battery capacity. As we know, battery kilowatt hour equals to voltage times ampere hour. In this graph, the area of x-axis and y-axis is kilowatt-hour. We can clearly see that as the temperature decreases, the battery kilowatt-hour decreases. This phenomenon is rooted in the fact that colder temperature can result in reduced conductivity of the battery electrolyte, leading to the decreased discharge capacity. Low temperature affects battery discharge efficiency mainly due to the following factors. First is the increased internal resistance. In this diagram, from left to left, it can be seen that the internal resistance gradually increase as the temperature decreases. Among other factors, the battery electrolyte plays the most crucial role in influencing the battery performance under cold temperatures. When operating in colder environment, the battery electrolyte viscosity surge and even partially solidified, consequently leading to the reduced conductivity of the battery. Second is the increased charge transfer resistance. The increase of charge transfer resistance stands as a significant contributor to performance deterioration under colder temperature. For instance, the charge transfer resistance of cathode based on lithium ion phosphate batteries was found to be threefold higher at minus 20 degrees Celsius compared to conditions at room temperature. Third is the lithium plating. The lithium intercalation resistance of the negative electrode is significantly greater than that of the positive electrode of the intercalation. This results in a situation that Lithium ion can be relatively swiftly be intercalated from the positive electrode, but the phase delay when it comes to be embedded in the negative electrode. Lithium that cannot be embedded in the negative electrode can only attain electrons on the surface of negative electrode, formation a silver white metal lithium element. Consequently, this process diminishes battery capacity. Moreover, this lithium plating process takes on the form of dentures, which possess the potential of bridge the separators and even lead to the internal short circuit. Having delved into the implication of low temperature setting on battery performance, let's pivot our focus on the high temperature, just as low temperature has significant influence on battery performance. The existence of elevated temperature brings a unique set of challenges and possibility for this is exceptional energy storage system. When addressing high temperature, we generally referring to situations surpassing 40 degrees Celsius to comprehend the implication of elevated temperatures on battery performance. 
It is essential to start with its heat sources. Heat within the batteries can be categorized into two types, reversible heat and irreversible heat. There are four primary sources of heat generation within the batteries. Reversible reaction heat stemming from reactions. Secondly, heat produced due to battery electrode decomposition during instance of overcharge and overdischarge. Solar heat originating from battery resistance and polarization heat stemming from polarization reactions. The polarization heat eventually signifies heat generated when lithium ion overcome the resistance caused by intercalation or the intercalation solid electron light interface film. So what kind of impact does elevated temperatures have on battery performance? Primarily, it manifests in terms of battery aging, service life, and battery safety issues. First is the accelerating aging. High temperature will accelerate the chemical reactions within the batteries, thereby accelerate the deterioration of electron materials. This phenomenon will lead to a quicker decline in battery cycle life. The research indicates that for every 10 degrees Celsius increase beyond 40 degrees Celsius in battery operating temperature, the battery cycle life gets half. Secondly, is thermal runway. Severe overheating can initiate a dangerous sequence event known as thermal runway. These trend reactions can trigger a rapid gas emission leak and even potential fire or explosion, representing significant safety risk. However, when we are using the batteries, we can reasonably avoid the influence of temperature on batteries' performance. Regarding the management of low and high temperature, at present, there are battery management systems to control the battery, so it could solve the temperature problems caused by the battery itself. The BMS can balance the voltage and current of the batteries and perform temperature protections to prevent the batteries being damaged due to the low and high temperature. However, in the high and low temperature in real life, although there is BMS protection to against extreme environment, we will also adopt some configurations to better prolong the charging and discharging performance and life of the battery in different environments. For instance, in order to cope with low temperature, the batteries can integrate a heating field within its structure. When the external environment reaches below zero degrees Celsius, the heating field can heat the battery first after starting the batteries. After reaching the working temperature, the batteries operate normally. For countering high temperature environment, a battery could be positioned within an indoor air condition, setting to mitigate its operational temperature. In more safety conscious designs, some products might even feature an integrated fire extinguished system to prevent the occurrence of thermal runaway. These measures all can effectively prevent the battery from being working at low and high temperature and being damaged. Through today's video, we aspire to equal you with valuable knowledge for informed battery usage. If you have any inquiries and topics related to the batteries in Trigger U, please feel free to share your thoughts in the comment sections. We will carefully select and adjust the most hot topics in our future video. Thank you for your listening. See you next time. Bye.